College basketball is underway. At up to watch Carson Edwards. Carson Edwards fires and it goes in and out. Fairfield pushing now. Kasababu with the step out. That's a th three. And the Fairfield has that three-point shot. Kasababu, the Congo native, puts in the second three. And sport. The patented Grady Eifert move. We'll shoot a three on one play and the next time down. Has stepped up to the task. They miss inside there. Eric Hunter came on for Edwards as well. It's they a, saw that all year long last year. It's a 12-2 boiler. And that started that run was Grady Eifert with the and one as Carson. But personally, he's laughing that one off and maybe some freshman jitters like you mentioned. Fairfield going to the post now. And Kasababu before that one being a two. Carson Edwards with eight points already. He had six in the exhibition against Marion as Purdue causes another turnover. It's going to be traveling on Cap quickly for Fairfield. And now Carson Edwards worth it in, in some scenarios. Obviously Purdue's best player, and you're right, he's got to play smarter knowing that. Picks up his second. And now Fairfield trying to go on a run of their own. Felix Lametti, another new Stag on the floor. But they feed Stags trying to work themselves back into this game. They led early. But since then, it's been all Purdue who's leading 28 to 16 now. But Kasababu, make players we saw on the depth chart for them. As now Fairfield looking to respond any way they can offensively. And they go to their big man, Kasab School. So much experience. And Painter, an experienced coach himself, is aware of the foul situation. He pulls Boudreaux. The one, Caleb Biggie Swanigan. Those are some nice shoes that you can try and fill. You can try and fill them. <laughs> it, is, it is a long road. He aspires to be a similar type player. He has the build. He's lost over 40 pounds since coming to here to be as good as Caleb Swanigan was. Stefanovic got out of control there and get on the board. They haven't had a field goal in over four minutes and 30 seconds. A deep three from Taloff to put something together before the half ends. Ryan Klein, he's going to drive. A rare two by him, but he finished. Perez says he's able to dash into the lane there and finish at the rim. Kasababu missing only four shots is... Trying to keep his efficiency up. They've relied on him to keep the stags in the game. And Kasababu averaged nine points. Already eclipsed that in the first half as this. Great inbounds play by the Boilermakers. Watch out for Kasababu. Kasababu. Goal of the year nationally. One to look out for for all teams. Kasababu. Good closeout defense from Klein there. As Talaferro got hot at the end of the half from especially three. Kasababu finds Alvar. Great defense here by the Boilermakers. Bell Eastern as a guard. His height comes into play, being able to keep that shot from happening. Talaferro hot. He will stay hot until he has decided to be done. And he should just keep shooting it. Eastern here, a little baby hook misses off the glass. Austin quite a bit of offense in the offseason. Kasababu picks up as will run the point. Just under 12 in the second half to go. Alvarez to him. Instead they'll go with Kasababu. Babu against Harms. Just misses at the rim and he finds Matt Harms. And now they'll go back to Harms in the post. Trying to work against Cast by a lot of teams. That's something they're going to focus on, I'm sure, this season. Kasababu, six foot eight, has been impressive against a lengthy Purdue squad for Purdue. No changes for Fairfield as with six points. A missed shot there, cleaned up soon as Carson Edwards showing his versatility, as you see there, Matt. Hall Sasha Stefanovic trying to add to it, but he turns it over. He had the right idea. But now the Stags trying to get some fast break points. Watch out. 